Welcome back to the second part of the tutorial. Now I'll show you how I book using TEW. <clears throat> like I said in the first part, you're going to want to start booking all of your matches first to get that 90 minutes of wrestling time down. And then you'll have the 30 minutes left to fill it with angles. It's just much easier because usually you will end up having more angles than matches. <clears throat> so uh, get started. And I'm not sure if a lot of people know this, but you could use the keyboard to type in the name of the wrestler, and it's a lot quicker than cycling through with the drop-down menus. I always put a winner and a loser, even though it's kind of redundant in a one-on-one -on -one match. I'm sure you, uh, if you check out the FAQ, you can uh, figure out what a lot of these booking notes mean. For a guy like Gunner, I always use the Protect. He's still a little green stats-wise. And when you have younger, greener guys, you would also want to use the Script Match instead of uh, Open. I mean, I'm pretty sure you could handle booking the matches. I'm going to pause here and come back when I have all of them laid out. All right, now that I got all the matches down, um, it came to about 86 minutes, and the recommended time was 90. We're good there, so now we can start putting in our angles. <clears throat> As you can see, this is laid out pretty much the same exact way as the angles are in EWR. You have your one versus one angles, two versus two, and so on, authority. For the first segment here, I have a Hulk Hogan promo on Sting, so that's a hype segment. And now just order it back up to the beginning <clears throat> by uh, going over to move segment back. And the next segment is a continuation of the same one, but I have Kurt Angle coming out and joining in. So I'm going to do it as a separate angle. <clears throat> and we're going to use the hype two versus one because it's Angle and Hogan talking about sting and again type their names in and use tab it's a lot easier and quicker and I'm gonna add about 10 minutes because it's one of those big clusterfuck opening segments that we see a lot And here I have the knockouts are shown awaiting Bischoff's announcements. What I like to do is go in and use a video angle with eight people. And we can go in and uh, just fill it in with knockouts names.
shit. Sorry about that. So, I mean, you can see the benefit of having these gen general, generic, non-specific angles because, it, like, why the fuck would you want to have angles that are so specific that it fills, like, 500 angles in your pack? It's just, it's not really anything I'd want to do. I got Bischoff naming Karen Angle the new authority, so you can probably go to these, one of these authority uh, angles. I'm just going to use authority gets one month deadline because it really doesn't matter. They are both rated on microphone and they're both a subject in this angle. So it's going to be Eric Bischoff and Karen Angle. And you see, because we booked all the matches first, it's a lot easier. We have 114 minutes booked of 120. So the remaining angles are going to want to take about six minutes left. You could adjust the time and all that. I'm going to pause here and fill the rest of the angles in. I think it's uh, you can pretty much see how to do this now. And I'll be back in just a sec. And we're back. Okay, as you can see, I've got all the angles in here, and I've ordered them the way I wanted to. But we are at 136 of 120 minutes for the show, so we're going to have to cut down. I can shave 10 minutes off of the first two angles, so that's what I'll do. And still got six to go, so I'm going to actually cut down on one of the matches because, I mean, I think I'm pretty safe to do that. A sports entertainment company has a lot of angles to match time, so we'll give that a try. And we're at what we should be. Now, as you know, on TW, you can add... Uh, pre-show segments i usually don't unless like i have a young guy i want to put against veterans before his debut but uh you can play with that however you want so uh this is pretty much what i do um just look through the angles in the inspired angle pack it you might start off a little slow but as you get used to what angles are there and how to book it really isn't too bad all right uh that's it and uh thanks for joining and we'll be back next time.